my work is in quantum information and one of the problems that we want to solve are cryptographic problems between two parties that don't trust each other. For example, you and an ATM machine. You don't trust the machine because maybe I put it there to steal your password. The machine doesn't trust you because maybe you are not who you claim to be. So ideally, you want to have some kind of mechanism where you can compare the password that only you know in your head to the password stored inside the machine. So currently, this is not quite the case because you're actually walking up to the machine and you're punching your pin code and there it goes. So the point is, can you do some kind of protocol where you can compare the passwords without actually giving it away? So it turns out that it's not possible to do this without assumptions, but there are physical assumptions where we can exploit quantum effects, effects of small particles of light, to make the protocol secure. So we work in designing protocols that can accomplish such tasks. We have also shown that in principle we can do this, even though the protocols that we have now are quite inefficient. We've also done an experiment where we actually, with a laser, send small particles of light that implement such protocols. Currently, unfortunately, uh, this experiment is very large. I mean, the laser and all of the equipment takes up an entire table. But one of the long-term goals in the future is to design devices which are extremely small. Um, maybe they fit in your cell phone, like a small laser, which with you can communicate with the machine and, for example, identify yourself securely. So how does this work? So it turns out that small particles, like a particle of light, a photon, behaves very differently than large objects. It obeys so-called quantum effects. It turns out, in particular, that small particles of light obey uncertainty relations, which are not there for very large objects. So basically our protocols exploit these quantum effects to achieve security. So maybe in the future, you will take your phone, you will go up to the ATM machine, and we will use these quantum effects to withdraw money from the machine. Mm -hmm.